really like these socks because they have like a Bible verse on them. Can you talk about your season uh, you've had so far and what you expect to happen on Sunday? So yeah, so far, uh, a lot of fun this season. Always looking to get better and, and grow. So, so far I feel like each match, I feel like I've gotten better, I feel like I've gotten sharper. And uh, super excited for the matchup this Sunday. We have Missouri. Um, I'll be wrestling Keegan O'Toole, so it'll be a good battle and uh, looking forward to wrestling him. So there's 285,000 high school wrestlers. Think about that. It's a lot of freaking wrestlers. 50 states, 285,000, okay? 2,400 of them are wrestling Division I. You know, I got 2,400, there's 80 teams, and on average, each team has 30. It might be closer to 2,500, but, but just for round numbers, there's 2,400 Division I wrestlers. You guys are all part of that. You're part of that 2,400, right? That's .008, right, of the wrestlers. You guys are in the .008, right? So right now, you guys are like way ahead of the odds. It's like less than 1%, less than a quarter of a percent, right? Make it to the Division One level. If you're wrestling and you're starting, there's 80 teams. There's 10 starters on each team. What's that math, ready? 800. Yeah, let's check that. Okay, ready? You got nervous for a second. David Carr is number four ranked uh, guy in the nation, pile for pile, right? That's four guys out of 285,000 high school wrestlers. You know what that number is? 0. .00001. You guys see when I say pressure is a privilege? You guys are in the elite. You guys that are wrestling Sunday are in the elite elite. And he's in, in the elite, elite, elite match. And I could go down the, you know, number three versus number five at heavyweight. 57, number 10, uh, 12 versus number 11. You follow my logic? Okay, good. 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 Hey. 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 Same situation right here. Can you post and Grammy and go to your head, Car? Oh. Only time you go loud. <laughs> post and go to your head. Can you buy Grammy? Yeah, something like that. Uh -huh. Yep, now you can hit bite. But if he's right here, right? Alright, here we go. So now you're gonna go go coach Cole on us right here. Right there, you take off running, a la St. John. What's the one thing that just keeps you going when you're wrestling? Like at practice and stuff? Yeah. And just throughout the season. Uh I would think like, you know, during the season, my faith and my focus on like building as a wrestler, you know, my my focus is really just to be the best wrestler I can be, uh, technically, um, my shape, my strength, all those things. And then with that, I think my faith helps me have fun, enjoy it. I know my identity is in Christ, so I'm not really worried about the results. I just kind of focus on just the process and getting better and having fun. Incorporate whatever you've learned in here. Incorporate it. Good, good, good. 96% ready. Yeah, I would say um, one thing that just like something that's always helped me is just finding something to believe in. I think that, you know, everyone should believe in something, whether they believe in um, a higher power, believe in, in, you know, their family's belief and their values and things like that. For me, it's my faith in Jesus. And so yeah, yeah, yeah. I believe that he's my Lord and Savior. And I believe that my identity is in him and that, you know, he's with me wherever I go. And so no matter whether it's a good time or a hard time, I know that he's with me and that gives me a lot of comfort and to be able to wrestle and just to go up, go throughout life.
Thank you.